dun, dun. <laughs> so I'm here at the start of um, the Paris Triathlon. It's rather overwhelming, to be quite honest. Uh, there's lots of people around who look like they know what they're doing, and I clearly don't. And um, you can see behind me where I will be swimming, uh, 1,500 metres. It's <laughs> very scary. I'm going to go and try and find my bike. The swim was ridiculous, no amount of training could prepare me for this. There were men swimming over the top of you and you were getting kicked in your ribs. There were weeds that made it really hard to do front crawl so there was a bit of breaststroke going on. And you know it took quite a bit not to panic and just to keep going. By the time I got to the bike, um, the first few kilometres were on cobblestones which was quite challenging. And then I really started to enjoy it. It was a massive hill right at the start. Um, but around the park it was beautiful and I was trying to keep up with all the blokes and really, really worked hard. Which meant by the time I got to the run, I didn't really have much left in my legs. Um, you know, I was doing 60 second walk, 60 second run, but my heart rate was so high, it was so hot. But the route was beautiful. And when I got to the end, I was so relieved to get out of the sun. What an amazing event. Hi guys, it's Julie from the Fat Girls Guide to Running and I am coming to you live from the bottom of the Eiffel Tower where I have just completed my first ever Olympic distance triathlon. I am, um, I'm going to take my glasses off, um, I am so uh, um, overwhelmed, really emotional at how well I did because like it's a proper triathlon here and it's full of like really fit people and um, I don't know like it was really tough the swim was really hard it was like you know every man for themselves like quite literally I got kicked in the ribs and smacked in the face and um, the, the cut off for the swim was an hour and I managed to do it in 55 minutes but <coughs> sorry I'm really really happy with and then the um, the cycle which I thought would take like two and a half hours I did in one hour 36 because and I, I felt it I felt like I was absolutely flying um, and then the run I mean you can see what the heat is like the run was a walk run walk run um, but I mean look at this for a setting um, you know so oh, you know don't hold back in signing up for things like this don't like look at the results and go oh my god I'm likely to be the slowest because it's quite possible that I came last today do I give a shit I absolutely do not and I can tell you one thing I will absolutely be doing another Olympic distance triathlon because I just it was incredible I really really enjoyed it and I'm really really proud of myself so just whatever it is you want to do you know fitness wise or just you know traveling just in your life just go for it you only get one life you know so go live it all right <laughs>